Big data. What exactly is it? Think of big data as both internal and external data collected from both traditional and digital sources. It's analyzed to drive improvements in your business, which sometimes leads to unexpected discoveries. Sometimes data is already structured a certain way, but often it's only partially structured or not at all. Think metadata or Twitter tweets. The data's always been around, but today it's processed in the blink of an eye. You've likely heard people talking about the three V's of big data, high volume, high velocity, and wide data variety. What's big about data is just how much of it there is, the volume. But giant data volumes are nothing new. What has changed is the desire to interpret this information. The problem is that traditional relational database management systems, or RDBMS, can't handle such big volumes. They're plagued by long query times and struggle with unstructured data. They're also expensive and sometimes unreliable. Another volume concern is how long the stored data remains valuable. When do you throw it out? Old data takes up the space, and it quickly becomes misleading. Another problem facing companies is the high velocity of data. This is the incoming data speed. Picture a tap open to maximum. Can you catch all the water? Can you do it in one go without pausing? And coming back to data, even when you're capturing data at high speed, you need to be certain of its consistency and completeness. Timeliness or latency is a velocity issue. Is the data being captured at a reasonable rate or is it too slow, which may make the data worthless? So for real-time analytics to be of any value, data storage and retrieval needs to happen at a high velocity. For example, think about your favorite music streaming site. Each time you log in, you instantly see a brand new list of songs and albums recommended for you, generated from all the data collected about you. All this data is a nightmare to manage. Trying to match data streams to specific events is a tough task, made even tougher by the overwhelming variety of data. Videos, photos, music, GPS and sensor signals, and billions of social media text messages. It's not structured, and it's estimated that this data makes up 80% of what companies store. So, there are various data types, but there's also a variety of sources, both inside and outside your company. A real game changer will be finding new ways to store and retrieve data as quickly as possible, or ways of packaging it for better analysis. While volume, velocity, and variety are the big Vs, don't forget there are some smaller Vs too. Value, veracity, variability, viscosity, and virality are all relevant to any big data plan. Big data is an evolving term in an evolving industry, so expect updates as our understanding of what data is and what it could be changes.